Welcome back, Dodger fans. We have the two by four workout today. So we're talking about two circuits, four exercises each. We're gonna take a break in between the two circuits, but for the most part, we're gonna be moving through as fast as we can with these four exercises. Pretty minimal equipment, okay? I'm gonna teach you how to do some exercises that we normally do with dumbbells or kettlebells or something, and teach you how to do them with a band. So we have split squats with a band that we're gonna start with. We are going to do kneeling paw off press forward to overhead with a band like we've done in the past with another variation. And then we're gonna go high row with a band. And in that circuit, we're gonna finish up with a physio ball circuit that we're gonna do glute bridges, hamstring curls, and then bent knee glute bridges. We'll take a break, we'll come back, and then we're gonna hit the next four exercises, which is gonna be dumbbell single leg RDL to a row, so a compound movement like we've been into the last few workouts. Then we're gonna go into leg lowering, which is an ab exercise and hip flexor exercise. We're gonna to go to a bridge to press. We're gonna use this band lying down on our back. Again, you have dumbbells and you wanna use dumbbells, by all means do, and then we'll finish with our friend, the box and the med ball. We'll do step ups to an overhead press. Looking forward to it, let's get going with the warm up. For the warm up, we are gonna hit some of the major moves that we're gonna hit during that. So we're gonna start with some knee hugs. Remember, lock out that leg at the bottom, okay? Knee hug up, single leg RDL out. We're going for 30 seconds on this side, okay? Separating those hips as much as we possibly can, and then getting into that left hip, reaching this right leg as far back as we can. We have single leg RDLs today, we have step ups. So this is just a nice variation that we can get into. Let's switch sides, let's go left knee up, back into that single leg RDL on the right side. My glutes and quads are really locking out on the right side. And then as I go back, I wanna feel my right glute working. The whole time I'm thinking about stepping my belly button into my spine. So we'll hit some of these stretches and we're gonna finish. I got my friend, the box right here. And we're gonna do some footwork with that just to get our heart rate up. Here we go, we're gonna go lunge with the left leg out, up and over to hit the lats because we have lats today. Lunge, up and over. Today's workout is coming from Sam Nicholson, who is our A-ball strength coach. Right now he's in South Carolina and he put a workout together for me today that I'm really excited for you guys to do. Let's roll that neck out, get those kinks out. Let's go the other way. Good. Get those arms loose. Let's go arm swings. Banded chest press, it's gonna be a little bit different. I have three different types of bands. You may not. You might wanna add a little bit of, uh, a little bit more resistance by grabbing both sides of the band maybe. Or if it's too big, making sure that you stay close to the band and not putting too much stretch on it. So I have a small band that I'm gonna do my paw off presses with. I have a medium band I'm gonna do my split squats with. And I have a big band that I'm gonna do my rows with. Okay, here we go. So a step, a box, anything that you have, you can just draw a line on the ground for all I care. But we're gonna move. Uh, we have about a minute 45 left. And let's just start running on that box nice and easy. Notice I'm moving my arms, just trying to keep some cadence going. And a half left. I'm gonna start to pick my pace up a little bit here. Get 
15. Five, we're gonna switch. Four, three, two, one. Now, just bouncing back and forth here. Forty-five left. Just getting that heart rate up. Forty left. Thirty left. Good. And then we'll get some box blasts going. Fifteen seconds. Lateral box blast. Five, four, three, two. Let's get going with the first set of our two by four. So we're going to start with split squats. Notice I've taken my band, I've stepped on it, and I put it over my shoulder. I'm going to put my back foot up on the box, and this is my resistance here. So I'm down and up, and we're going for 15. I'm going to work into my range of motion. So as I go, every set, every rep, I'm probably going to get a little bit deeper until I find my active range of motion. Five more. Four. Three. Two, one. Step on the other side. We'll go right into paw off press after this. Right leg. Good. Shoelaces are on the ground. I'm gonna squeeze my booty. I'm gonna pull into my belly button, press out and over. One, going to 15. Six, seven, eight, nine, 12. 15, other side. Right in to our high row, both knees down still. Fifteen of these. Again, squeezing that booty. Belly button in the spine. Other side, and then we're going to our hamstring curl circuit. Ten straight leg glute bridges, ten hamstring curls, ten bent knee glute bridges. Here we go. Again, if you don't have a ball, first exercise we ever did together, heels on the ground, walking it out. 
great exercise. Straight leg. Toes are pointing to the sky. 10. Now, booty stays up. Hip extension comes from our glutes. Knee flexion comes from our hamstrings. Now the knees stay bent. So the hamstrings are on. Can I get the glutes to work too? Five. Toning my inner thighs. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10. We're at 335 right now. Take your time getting back up. We're going to go back into those split squats. Driving through the heel. Good, let's switch sides. The band's great, I have constant tension. So even when I'm going down, even though it looks like it's slacking, I still got a pretty good resistance on here. 13, at the top, it's already pulling me back down. Pull up press. Glutes, core. Other side. Much tension as you can with your core and your glutes. Good, other side. Hamstring curl circuit after this. Grab your ball. If you don't have a ball again, that's okay. That's okay, we can do this on the ground. a little bit more time to rest after this one. We, we got through that one pretty quick. So straight up, 10 of them. Drive your heels in. Try not to let your legs flare out. Try to keep pointing your toes and your knees to the top of the ceiling. Nine, 10. Roll it in. it up. Ten of them. Six of them. Five, four, three, two. Good. We got a nice 50 second break here. Back through it one more time. First round of the two by four. First circuit of the two by four. 
30 seconds. Get that band ready. Most depth, most accuracy here too. So go deeper, stay on your heel. Get that glute involved, not just your quad, not just your knee. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Nice job. Other side. I step on this thing right in the middle. I get it all the way over my shoulder. That way I don't have to worry about holding on. I'm grabbing on a little bit to give me a little bit more resistance. I'm good and warm now. Nice work. Kneeling paw off press, here we go. Try not to arch my back. Four, five, get that motion through your scap. Press, scap, scap, down. Not lean back. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two, three, four, five, half, full kneeling, high row. Booty tight. Five more. Hamstring curl circuit, we get a little bit of a break. We get a little bit of a break. We got in a minute and a half to get this in. Great leg, dig through your heels. Listen, if you feel this in your back, go to your calves. From there, we make our lower legs shorter and we can rely more on the proximal part in the midsection. Okay. From here, curl. Now bridge. In, and I want thighs coming together. Two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine. Give me a hold here. Five more seconds. Inner thighs, the inner thighs. Come on. Squeeze your glutes and good. All right. Let's take a little bit of a break. Let's come back. We're going to hit the second part of our two by four. Couple options here for the single leg RDL the row. I'm gonna start with the band the second time around. I'm gonna grab some dumbbells and show you what I'm doing. 10 on each side. So you're gonna go single leg RDL row. See if you can do this without touching your left foot.
to the other side. Last one. Good, now you're gonna lie down on your back, grab that same band, wrap it around your left foot. I'm gonna do it twice. I'm holding my left leg up, lowering my right one down. Belly button through. If you don't have a band, put your leg up on a doorway. Good, now let's switch sides. I wanna make sure my booty's on the ground too. The key here is hip separation. Eight, nine, 10, good. So we just lengthen those hamstrings out We've already done those glute bridge, or excuse me, that hamstring curl circuit. Now, let's get that static glute bridge in, and we're gonna press up. Holding the other side, 15 presses. Good, and then step ups. Heel on the box. Ten on each side. Let's go the other way. Two more. Right back in to your single leg RDL with a row. I'm gonna do it with the dumbbells this time. I'm gonna grab some 20s. Good. Let's Footing, row, one, already messed it up, two, I was being held down by the band, it was helping me out. Now I gotta find a whole new level of stability.
two more. Very nice. Going back to that leg lowering. Switch it up, stand on each side, get a firm grip around that foot. Apologize for the lack of conversation today. I think I'm just a man on a mission. Very good, now let's take that band. We're going right into those presses, 15 on each side. You guys are doing great. Second set of the second circuit of the two by four. One, five, 10, 15, five. Keep holding that tension in the glutes and the opposite arm. 10, very nice. Minute and a half to get the step ups in. Minute and a half to get the step ups in. Here we go. Can press up, my garage is too short, so I'm gonna be pressing out. Switch it up. And 10. I'm thinking about pushing down on the ground as I'm going back up. Last one. Switch it up. Last one, leg lowering. Can you do this without the band now? Now that you've got the gist, can you hold both legs up in the air? Pressing your belly button into the ground. I'm pulling this right leg behind me. Switch it up. Band for the presses. We're almost there. 15 presses each side. Five. 10. 
15. Very nice. Step ups and we are done. One more. Two more. One more. Forty-five seconds to spare. Another great workout, Sam. Appreciate you putting that one together for us. I get smoked, everybody. Until next time, everybody, stay safe and stay active.